I've seen people where it rules their lives, you know, who want to be thinner or have bigger boobs, and how it wears them down, and I just don't want that in my life. Please subscribe and share with your friends. Stay with this video till end. Singer Adele is a Grammy Award winning artist whose throwback, soulful sound has made her an international success with hits like Rolling in the Deep, Someone Like You and Hello. Adele was born in North London, England, on May 5, 1988, eventually attending the Performing Arts Brit School. Her first two albums, 19 and 21, earned her critical praise and a level of commercial success unsurpassed among her peers, with the artist selling millions of albums worldwide and winning multiple Grammys. She also received a songwriting Oscar for the James Bond track Skyfall. After becoming a mom, Adele returned to the charts in autumn 2015 with the ballad Hello, the lead single from what was dubbed her comeback album 25. In 2017, she won five Grammys for her work on 25 including album, record and song of the year for Hello. Adele Laurie Blue Atkins was born on May 5, 1988, in North London, England. She was the only child of Penny Atkins, an arty mom who was just 18 at the time of her birth, and a Welsh father, Mark Evans, who left the family when Adele was only four years old. Evans remained in contact with his daughter up until her teen years, when his problems with alcohol and increasing estrangement from his daughter caused their relationship to deteriorate. By contrast, Adele grew close to her mom, who encouraged her young daughter to explore, and not to stick with one thing. Early on, Adele developed a passion for music. She gravitated toward the songs of Lauren Hill, Mary J. Blige and Destiny's Child. But her true, eye-opening moment came when she was 15 and she happened upon a collection of Etta James and Ella Fitzgerald records at a local shop. There was no musical heritage in our family, Adele told The Telegraph in a 2008 interview. Chart music was all I ever knew. So when I listened to the Ettas and the Ellas, it sounds so cheesy, but it was like an awakening. I was like, oh, right, some people have proper longevity and are legends. I was so inspired that as a 15-year-old I was listening to music that had been made in the 40s. Adele's debut album, 19, which is named for the singer's age when she began recording the project, went on sale in early 2008. Led by two popular lead singles, Hometown Glory and Chasing Pavements, the record rocketed Adele to fame. Her much-anticipated follow-up album, 21, again named for her age at time of recording, did not disappoint upon its release in early 2011. Tapping even deeper into Adele's appreciation for classic American R&B and jazz, the record was a monster hit, selling 352,000 copies within its first week. In 2012, Adele swept the Grammy Awards, taking home six wins, including Album of the Year. This record is inspired by something that is really normal and everyone's been through it, just a rubbish relationship, she said as the ceremony. In 2013, Adele won her seventh Grammy, Best Pop Solo Performance, for her hit single Set Fire to the Rain. That same year, the singer won a Golden Globe and an Academy Award for Skyfall, the theme song for the 2013 James Bond film of the same name. On June 29, 2012, Adele announced on her website that she was pregnant with her first child. The baby's father is Adele's boyfriend, Simon Konicki. Adele spoke to People magazine about being a mother, I really want to be a mom. I better start getting on with it. She said, adding that she wants to have a trio of boys by the time she's 30. She gave birth to her son Angelo on October 19, 2012. Please subscribe and share with your friends. Thanks for watching.